Tochter, I am ready. Moments away, Igor. Moments away. scientists are quite like this. That's right. Some scientists even study moral issues, like the one in the chapter Mystery, which asks, should short kids who are otherwise healthy be given drugs to make them taller? Biology is the study of life. <laughs> and uh, it's a huge field of science, and it covers every aspect of our lives. We like it because it allows us to have adventures and meet really interesting people. <laughs> I think they're going to like this one, guys. All right. Oh. Oh, you guys put everything inside of me? One more time, I think I need to go back up. Uh, oh. So we know that biology is the study of life. We also know that biologists study the mysteries of the natural world. But did you know that their discoveries and experiments directly affect their lives? So who are biologists and what exactly do they do? Uh, a biologist studies living things. Uh, they do research on whatever stuff they're interested in. From germs to mammals, that's what biologists do. Somebody that loves animals and loves seeing what they do. It's a person that's always curious. Maybe what, wired rims. Okay. Okay. Maybe bald. Bald. <laughs> bald. They're old. 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 <laughs> uh, they look like people that's curious about their surroundings. Okay. They love. They do what they love and they love what they do. You know, it's a job that they they go into every day with their heart, mind, body, and soul. <laughs> I'm Ron Nelson, part of the Untamed Science crew. I'm a marine biologist, and I love what I do because it allows me to explore the mysteries around me. And you see, I've learned to ask questions and find ways to answer them. Because wherever I travel in the world, there's always new things to explore. I became a plant biologist because plants are fascinating. Imagine being stuck in one place, but have the ability to make your own food, get your own water, and defend yourself against things that might eat you. My passion for the sea has been the driving force for me to study biology. But I think my favorite thing about the ocean is that no matter how young or old you are, there's always something cool and exciting for you to explore. Howdy, I'm Hazen, and I'm a bug and reptile specialist. Basically, I love animals, and I love to have fun. Because life is full of discovery and full of exploration. Woo! Hi, I'm Haley, and I love being a biologist because even knowing just a little bit about the world around me and having a curiosity about it can help me to have adventures wherever I am. Like right now, I'm frozen to the bone 
and there is a biological reason for that. Well, I too have always been fascinated by water, and that made me want to become a marine biologist. I mean, such a great percentage of the Earth's surface is covered in water, and yet we know so little about it. That made me want to know more. Maybe you can become a scientist too and help us explore a world of untamed science. It can change your life and life on our planet. Here are some more reasons to consider. That's the way the world is now. There are lots of people in the world, and there's still lots of nature in the world. And science is the way that we can try and figure out how humans can best continue to coexist with the natural world in a way that allows us to continue to live the way we want and allows the world's ecosystems to survive in a way that they provide us with what we need. There's always something new, and there's always something unexpected, and there's an entire world of unexplored and undiscovered things out there, and that makes biology really exciting. Basically, if you think life's important, it's um, really valuable to know more about it in all its forms. Studying biology is absolutely critical for all of us because we need to have an understanding of the rules, the basic biological tenets by which all of our ecosystems function. They're also going to dictate where we can live and how long and how successful we can be as a species. So probably the funnest part of being a biologist is that you basically, your job is to sit around thinking about what's cool about the world and how you can learn more about it. And then actually going out into the world, in my case going out into the ocean and trying to learn more about it and discover new things. To me, the best feeling is sitting on a log in the middle of nowhere and just enjoying the peace and quiet of nature and knowing that, you know, because people go into this profession, it will always be there for somebody. I get to play with computers. I get to go diving in exotic locations. I get to see things that people have never seen before. And I get to discover things that nobody have ever known existed. I mean, it's just one exciting thing after another. And it's never, ever, ever boring. Now, I don't make a lot of money doing what I do. But you know, you don't need a lot of money if you end up enjoying everything you do. And I got to tell you, if I had a choice between making a lot of money on a job I didn't enjoy and enjoying every single day of my life, there's no question which one I would take. Okay, our journey through life is about discovery, and there's no better way to discover amazing places and people than by being a scientist. The more you learn about biology, the more it will open a world of interesting new questions and adventures. Every place you explore will tell a new story, even if it's in your own backyard. So in the end, being a scientist is about asking questions about the world and using a scientific process to find answers. And that's what we'll be doing this year. It's not about us. We're just here to help you see what it means to be a biologist. So one thing's for sure. Together, we'll investigate all kinds of interesting phenomena and meet curious scientists to help answer our questions. And until next time, never stop exploring your world. Thank you.